to a lot on the line and the likelihood of a tension-packed occasion. It's West Ham United, they face Tottenham Hotspur and the action comes your way next on EA TV. It is East London versus North London. West Ham United against Tottenham Hotspur and thoroughly looking forward to this derby. I'm Derek Ray. With me for commentary is Stuart Robson. Stuart, this should be fascinating. Well, it should be. This stadium has its critics, but when Spurs come here, the atmosphere is... Really good diving save. <laughs> Trying to deliver it accurately. And the delivery lacked a bit of guile. Harry Kane. On the ball, Reguilon. A bit of running room now on the wing. Son. Rebier. And blocked for now. And there's the delivery. Well, goal kick, just as it was looking promising. He has very much been the talk of the town going into this match. And the reports have been confirmed. He has decided to end what's been a brilliant career at the end of this season. A huge loss for the club, you've got to say, Stuart. Well, what a player he's been, and still is. But he obviously thinks his body can't cope anymore, which is a great shame. They're certainly going to miss him here. Fredericks. Great strong tackle, throw in forthcoming. Suchek. Promising position this. And space for the cross. And the pass not finding its target. Well, Ivan Perisic has been the focus of considerable attention prior to this match. The rumours coming out of the camp, Stuart, are that this may be his last season, but he's considering hanging up his boots. Well, if it is true, he'll be a big miss to everybody. He's been such a great player for them, but I'm always pleased to see a player retire before their powers start to wane. At the moment, he's still having a big impact on this team. Suchek. A fine reading of the situation. Bentancur. And Hoybier with it. I must say, this looks promising. And it's gone behind for the corner. Can he deliver it with accuracy? Harry Kane! Has done it the first goal of the contest here well here it is again it's a good delivery from the corner and it ends up with a fairly simple finish certainly not much the goalkeeper can do about that Well, the action underway once again, and the onus is on West Ham to find a response now. Keeping the ball moving. Aaron Cresswell. Now he must favour the cross. Cutting the ball back. No ball. Antonio. No foul, Spurs advantage. Hoybier. It's with Bentancur. Lucas. Advantage, Spurs. Hoybier. Now Son. 
Harry Kane. Bentancourt. And they continue to advance. And a lot of options here. And a goal! They've added to the lead. Much needed security. Well, here's the replay, and it shows how patient they were in the build-up. Just so assured, waiting for the right moment. And then the finish is fairly simple in the end. That's a good goal. So, 2-0 now. Spurs pushing forward with options available. And return to Son. Lucas Moura. Lucas Moura. Well, he didn't miss by all that much. Well, he struck it quite nicely, but the keeper was always in control of the situation. He knew that was going wide. For Niles. He's using his strength to good effect. Well, the referee wasn't going to let that go. And the problem not completely solved. Well, let's see what they have in store for them on the break. Kane. Son. Opportunity. And it goes. The lead just gets bigger. Surely they can't let this slip now. Well, as you can see, it was a fairly simple finish in the end, but you still have to be in the right place, keep your composure and finish it off, and that's exactly what he did. Well, there it is. Spurs have controlled the possession, and that's been because of their ability to win the ball back so quickly. Their pressing has been excellent, and they just haven't stopped working. It's been a fantastic performance up to now. Vlasic. Suchek. This is looking threatening. Ryan Fredericks. And it's with Tomasz Suchek. Well, time just challenged magnificently. And the electronic board delivers the news. Two minutes of stoppage time. Kane. And Son! Not at all problematic for the goalkeeper. So half-time here, the referee brings the first 45 to an end and Spurs hold the advantage. So off and running again here, and I must say it really was a sparkling first half showing by Spurs. Right here. It's with Bentancourt. And possession lost, intercepted. Antonio. And it's with Tomasz Suchek. A fine reading of the situation. And a goal to let you know about in the Wolves game. Let's hear about that goal from Alex. And it's a goal for Wolves. The defender was caught in possession just before the goal. He won't want to be watching that back. It's now 2-1 with 50 minutes played. Cheers, Alex. Kane. And Kane saw his pass intercepted. 
Kane. Surely. And a fantastic diving save. They decided that now is the time to go to the bench. Can someone get on the end of this? Nodding it over. Well, he was more determined than his marker, but he just couldn't get it on target, could he? Don't forget, we have more live action from the Premier League coming up here on EA TV. It's West Ham United taking on Newcastle United. Really sitting deep now. That could be problematic. And intercepted it. Jared Bowen. Making excellent progress with the ball at his feet. Crossing possibilities. Suchek. Could be troublesome. Declan Rice. It's with Ryan Fredericks. Rice and blocked for now. Jafet Tanganga. Son. Fabier. Bentancourt. And slipped through beautifully. Bentancourt. A really vital interception. And a friendly reminder that we have more action from the Premier League coming up. It's Tottenham Hotspur facing Manchester United. Well, that should be a really good game between two entertaining teams in a great stadium. Can he play it in? And the opportunity goes a begging. He decided to hit that with power rather than going for placement. Number 30, Rodrigo Bentinger, to be replaced by number 9, Harry Winks. Harry Kane. Fabier. And it's Winks. Harry Winks now. Going about his defensive business with a minimum of fuss. For Niles. And the pass was just that little bit off. Nearly found its target. Fabier. Now Harry Kane. Winks. What a goal update to bring you in the Arsenal game. Alex Scott has all the news for us. It's a goal for Arsenal. The free kick was well executed, but it had a big deflection and it's gone in off the wall. It's now 1-0 with 76 minutes on the clock. Thanks for the update, Alex. He cuts it back. Oh, a vital interception. Son. Kane. Now Son. Another goal! The lead grows to four now. A rampant display. Well, here it is again. And just look how he turns away from his marker and then gets his shot away. That's a very good goal, you have to say. pass he might yet finish 
Bisuma. Spurs get the advantage from the referee. Kane. The end product just wasn't there. Well, let's join Alex Scott now, because I'm hearing, Alex, the situation has changed in the Wolves game. Yep, third goal for Wolves. They now lead 3-2 with 86 minutes on the clock. It may just turn out to be the winner, Derek. Alex, thank you very much. Well, the referee allowed them to continue, but now he's going to go back and hand out the yellow card, Stuart. Well, he thought he was going to get away with that, but quite rightly, he's got a book in. Chance to cross. Aaron Cresswell. Going to get a try. Body in the way. Well, the referee has instructed the fourth official to put two minutes on the board. And successfully cut out. Oh, good vision. And there it is. A goal. But will it be purely a consolation at this stage of the proceedings? They haven't been at the best. Well, here's the replay, and he shows great awareness to play this through ball. And then what a strike. That's hit with such ferocity. Certainly no stopping that. That's a great goal. blows his whistle it's full time here and Spurs have prevailed your assessment well they've been great defensively as we know but it was all about their front players today their movement awareness of space and speed of thought was just too much for their opponents they could have won this by a lot more